Hi, this will be my video for the October bullet journal setup. Uh, before I begin, I'm showing you here that I'm filming on top of a bed using a bed table. So, the footage will be a little shaky. So, let's begin. I think my color team for this month will be pink and black. So, I'm going to get these colors from my pencil case. Um, gray from Mad Liner. Pink Stabilibos. And pink pens from Muji and Sarasa. And Pilot Juice. Black pen also from MNG. Gel pen. So I'm going to put this here in this pencil holder. The theme that I'll be having for this month are sweets. So I'm using this uh, desserts stickers from Craft Easy and some planner stickers. I think it's from Recollections. For the cover page, I'll be attempting to use a Tombow dual brush pen in purple. This will be my first time doing some calligraphy. So forgive me for the mistakes and if it's not really pretty. All I know about calligraphy is that you have thicker lines for downstrokes and thinner lines for upstrokes. If you have any more tips on how I can improve my calligraphy, please comment down below. For the stickers, I'll be using this cute ice cream and also probably that donut so this just at the upper right corner and for the donut i think i'll put it in the left lower corner and here i'm just breezing through the small stickers that i'll be using as a background for the cover page of the month so i think i'll be using these small ice cream stickers and probably those cake stickers those cherries and i think i use some watermelon also then, I'm trying to save for some stickers for the next few pages. So, I just drew some ice creams into the cover page using this pink gel pen. I drew some little hearts also together with the small ice cream at the background. So here's the finished monthly cover page. For the first section, this will be the monthly achievements page. I mean section so I wrote using metallic pink pilot juice pen and then place a small sticker in front and then some borders using stabilibus pink for the next section this is the Campbell achievement section so similar but the sticker was placed at the end so for the third section this is the audiobook tracker. The third page is the budget tracker. I think I'm using Sakura Jelly Roll here. And then placing a small sticker in front. 
with the similar border of the stabula boss. My usual is to create three columns, one for the date, the second column for the item description, and the third column for the price. I'm using the Pilot Fudenoske Blue for the Legend of the Debit and the Sarasa Pink Pen for the Credit. For the fourth page, we have the Self-Development Tracker. So, I'm using actually a cute little watermelon sticker in front. Next is the random ideas tracker. Here I use a pretty little cherry sticker in front of the title. Next is we have the YouTube or blogger tracker and I put a little ice cream in front. For the last page, I think I chose the pineapple here to put in the in front of the fluid tracker and I place a color pink for those dates which I drank without sugar or water and gray for those drinks with sugar. And then, I just place the days of the week from 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 up to the date of 31. The last section is the exercise tracker wherein I place a slightly bigger watermelon sticker at the end of the title. And then the usual pink border. The representation for this section is uh, pink if with exercise or gray if I did not exercise. Then similar to the fluid tracker, I place the dates from 1 to 31 divided into 10 so there are a total of three columns and the fourth column uh, with one date for the 31st then I just place uh, more stickers for this chocolate cake at the corner foiled cherry on top at the budget tracker we have ice popsicles so here's a flip tool of the finished October 2019 bullet journal setup. And that's it. Thank you for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe to this channel to see more videos of this type. Please watch my other YouTube videos as well to support this channel. Thank you. Oh,